Our homes right now after an evacuation earlier when construction workers hit a gas line. The city of Lafayette was doing maintenance on the 500 block of Roosevelt Street this morning when the line was hit. KTC's Carrie Beal talks to residents who say they're concerned if the work is being done properly. Around 9.30 Tuesday morning, Carl Cousin got a knock on his door. On the other side of that door, a police officer telling him to evacuate. The entire morning was disrupted, you know, nobody got to work or, you know, whatever they needed to be. And the other thing is, is that we were, you know, by definition, you know, in, in some danger here. Workers have been doing utility maintenance on Roosevelt Street for over a month. LUS Director Terry Huval says the reason the evacuation was necessary, an unmarked natural gas line was hit. In this case, you have been responsible for the natural gas company to mark it. They've been breaking the concrete with, with what is essentially a front end loader that has a big uh, hammer-like foot on the front of it. Cuval explains the front loader would have been the right piece of equipment to use if that gas line weren't there. We wouldn't have used that equipment had we known that there was another natural gas line there. It was repaired in a little over an hour and residents were then allowed to go back home. It would be nice to know if, 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 uh, if, the, if the work was being done properly, if it was being supervised like it should have been. Now when I spoke with another resident who lives in this area, he said he's not too concerned with the construction that's going on and he was happy the incident was taken care of quickly. Reporting in Lafayette, Carrie Beal, KTC TV3. Thank you, Carrie. And Atmos Energy tells us they are looking into exactly what happened with their gas line and whether the line was marked. 